and I guess you can go next year. I, I'm Alex. Um, I'm from Vancouver, but I'm studying in Halifax. That's how I came to Fredericton. So what brings you to this lovely uh, city of Fredericton? So we are both here for the National Trust for Canada Heritage and Office Conference. Yeah, so we're both sort of involved in heritage in some way, which brought us out to the Penelope downtown. Yeah. Right, so you're attending a university here then? No, not here in Fredericton, no. in Halifax. No, but I'm saying in the region. Yeah, kind of. We're, a lot of the focus studies have been on Fredericton in the area. The ones that I've done at least. Right, yeah, right, gotcha. So at the uh, Halifax uh, University? Dalhousie. Dalhousie University, okay. And uh, so you'll be here for for a couple more days? Uh, until tomorrow, the conference ends, and then we're going okay. back. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, so you're, uh, what is it that you're uh, more passionate about? Um, so, I don't know, I really like, I'm into history, and I really like historic downtowns and how those buildings will tell stories of a community. That's always really interesting to me. So, coming here has been really interesting because the downtown is so well preserved. And everyone here has also been very friendly and more than willing to share any fun tidbit or story that they have about the city's past. So I've learned a lot in just three days, which is incredible. So what place have you visited so far? So we've mostly been downtown. I've seen mostly like the city hall and then the legislature. And then we were walking through and doing like a study of some pubs and how we could like revitalize the space. But on the river, I read some of the plaques there. I've been just sort of walking around downtown. And you have visited a couple of museums? This is the first museum I've been to on this trip and it's... Frog school. I'm very excited to check it out. Same here. This is the first time I've been out. Now it's uh, I research military badges through badge collection. I'm uh, documenting them and describing them, writing descriptions for them, looking up their history of the unit that was involved and documenting that as well. So we'll be taking pictures and we'll have a full description of what the badge actually is before it goes on display. In uh, 1883, the Infantry School Corps was formed here. This is the birthplace of the Canadian Army. So all the regular army was formed, were trained by these soldiers. Right now my ceremonial guard from Fredericton represents that and my guardsmen come over here and give uh, trench tours because most of them are doing their master's degree in military history. I work for Parks Canada um, in heritage conservation. I've been doing this for about 10 years now. Um, I'm also a dedicated volunteer in my spare time. Um, and right now we're standing in the Fredericton Regional Museum. It's a local museum here in Fredericton that's run by uh, warm-hearted volunteers. Uh, and I think Everyone should get out uh, when they get a chance and visit their local museums and support their local volunteers. Uh, you never know what you'll discover, like this beautiful cooked rug that I found here today. Um, and I think it's really important to, to connect with your history, connect with your roots, understand where you're from, um, and if you can, give some of your time. Give some of your time to your community, um, and I'm sure it will go a long way in the end. Uh, and it would be much appreciated by your, your local